From one court to another, Novak Djokovic is back in training. The men's world tennis number one was released from Australian immigration detention on Monday after winning a legal challenge to remain in the country and defend his Australian Open title. Fans in Australia and back home in Serbia welcomed the news that Judge Anthony Kelly had found the Australian federal government's decision to cancel Djokovic's visa to be unreasonable because the player wasn't given enough time to speak to tennis organisers and lawyers to respond fully after he was notified of the intent to cancel his visa. The tennis star's family, including brother George, were delighted with the ruling, but it received a much more mixed reception from some Melbourne residents. I think the decision that it being overturned is a little bit unfair, because I still think, because, you know, obviously if you're coming from an international place, then you do have to be vaccinated. There's just both sides to it. There's the side where he's, you know, he was let in and then now he's come all the way here and they're saying that he can't play. But then on the other hand, there's all the players in the Oz Open who have done the right thing, have gotten vaccinated and they're, they're playing because they're allowed to be here. A spokesperson for Australia's Immigration Minister Alex Hawke said he was considering using his personal power to again revoke Djokovic's visa, which could include a three-year ban on re-entering.